continent people and communities are being considered as the most unwanted and treated. Maskers divide the most senior people by corrupting items and denying their need to daily living. Corruption is mostly practiced in our area whereby discrimination and tribalism are being taken part in every situation in life and every voluntary need for assistance for the needy people and avoid corruption when it's applying to the job, especially to a poor person. And the jobs are not secured as a result of not considering the ability of qualification and job discrimination for favor one over the other. Jobs are being corrupted to be the trade between the employer and employees. Our leader of Mandera County, who, whoever has the responsibility of our area from the top governor and MCS, we also need changes and takes move about it. The second one is battle. About the battle, we have a lot of challenges. The planners who are now in high schools and colleges that cannot pay the fees, he or she and their parents and students, they rely on bursary within our country. The students are being secured in different ways that one is paying over the other according to tribe. So our MB, if you will be elected for the coming 2022, we need to be changed and be alert in our area and avoid corruption. The third one is drought and war. In our area, due to communities misunderstanding of different people, four are exit due to land dropping over the small animal grazing land. This resulted to shifting from one another from one area to another. War also lead to migration and fighting over the water point area for the animal and people settling around for peace and peace. Drought can bring also war. This is the most effective challenges that everyone faces due to lack of rain and scarcity of food.